हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल आई होप यू आर डूइंग वेल आई प्रे फॉर यू ऑल गॉड गिव यू अ लॉन्ग लाइफ एंड यू लिव ऑलवेज हैप्पीली देयर प्लीज लाइक एंड शेयर दिस वीडियो एंड आल्सो सब्सक्राइब माय यूट्यूब चैनल आई हैव अ रिक्वेस्ट टू यू ऑल वाई दिस वीडियो टिल एंड फॉर सपोर्टिंग मी सो लेट स्टार्ट टू डू इन्फॉर्मेशन दीज आर सम अपडेट्स ऑन दिन आर बिफोर स्टार्टिंग द वीडियो I have to tell you something. Go to google.com and search janaropinions.com and open this site. Here you can see the latest news, Dinar opinions, and Dinar guru updates on a single page. So visit this site for more information. To remove the 3 zeros means taking them out of both the exchange rate and currency notes. In exchange Lower denomination notes will be introduced that do not have any zeros. These new notes will replace the ones with 3 zeros that have been removed. The lower denominations will not have any zeros, making them easier to manage and use. I read a report by Alok stating that the delete the zeros project is still ongoing. It mentioned that Al Sadani is also reported the supportive of the Iraqi dinar. The report was quite detailed and spanned over 5 pages and was released about 4 or 5 days ago. I have had conversations with individuals who have analyzed the financial data and they have come to the conclusion that the exchange rate for Iraq should be at least $1.30 for it to be a viable option. However, I have also heard from other sources that there will be a contract rate regardless of the method chosen. as it is necessary for the success of the oil for dinar initiative i agree with your comment about the reinstatement unfolding in an appropriate way it's understandable that there are many factors at play and that the rv is happening the way it is however it is concerning to hear that the money supply in iraq is over a trillion while the net worth of the country is only 16 trillion dollars us dollars It does seem unlikely that they can RV the currency with such a gap. But hopefully, the situation improves for the benefit of the people. It is more sound. It is more logical. It is safer at the onset that the rate should at least be 1 to 1 with the American dollar. Then a gradual increase via an international basket that floats the currency is very realistic. Sunday 30th of July. Very early today I received intel from a very high contact. I can't tell you what they said other than things are progressing. Everything is ready. It won't happen today but we may have very good news this week. News showing Sadani meeting with CBI governor Alok talking about measures to make the dinar strong and stable in the markets and talking about reforms. CBI saying nothing should be higher than the official CBI exchange rate of the street which is 1320. The budget and the rate change which are very much linked together they're like two peas in a pod. The budget cannot be implemented because it's a structured budget in a way where it can only be implemented at a specific certain time. That's why as of right now you haven't seen the budget implemented yet. neither have you see the rate change everything can only happen at a specific time